57 right. Lindbergh Tower, Skyhawk 2 Victor Victor, clear of 27 at Bravo 8. We're just going to uh, head to the south end. A little minor panicking because I didn't do any homework coming in here. There we go, diagrams up. Alright, well, it's safe to assume it's right traffic. To 1.3. Ready here. Gillespie Tower, four tank Delta, loud and clear now. Delta 7, three tank Delta, sorry about that. Era left downwind, Charlie 27 right, clear to land. Uh, left downwind, 27 right, and clear to land, 27 right. Douglas, four tank Delta. Right, left traffic it is, on the sweats. Lindbergh Tower, Skyhawk, two big Arm no foul. Clear of, uh, the active at Bravo 8. It's making me work for it, which I appreciate, to be honest. 200 feet to go to batter altitude. This is my crosswind turn now. This is her plane makes me smile. It's ridiculous. Like, I've actually had this big shaking grin on my face. Thank you for the help. Congratulations on the I 8 pass. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Big shit eating grin. There you go, stomp lumber into oblivion in the R22. I can go to bed. Happy with my day's accomplishments. Uh, Roger, turn on Charlie, uh, 436 here, Papa. <laughs> Such a good airplane. I can't believe how much I like it. I shouldn't like it as much, but I do. Ah, oh, good call, Peter. Yeah, Bravo airspace to the north. So, anything else I missed in the chat? Well, I'm downwind and should be doing my checks. And John Wayne Ground, 436 Sierra Papa. Like Alright, climbed up 700 feet while I wasn't paying attention. Let's do this. Fly the airplane for a minute. We'll be okay. Number six here, Papa. Can I have an HRV one? Uh, Squawk my Charlie. If able, if you're in Microsoft Flight Simulator, uh, you'll control the transponder from the uh, pilot client, actually. And below 120 speed checks. Oh, it wasn't trying to do very well there. Um, say again the transponder code. Four three six here, Papa. Number six here, Papa. I just need you to uh, swap busy, busy, a mode busy. Uh, switch your transponder from standby to low Charlie. Yeah. And if you're in, um, if you're uh, in Microsoft Flight Simulator, then you'll control that from the actual pilot edge client under the start menu. Oh, uh, Roger. How is the looking now? Sierra uh, four three six Sierra Papa. Plus uh, six Sierra, but still showing uh, standby. Number six here, Papa. Are you Microsoft Live family later? Uh, or prepared or explain? Uh, prepared, uh, for three six here, Papa. Number six here, Papa. You should be able to, do, uh, control that from your pilot. Alright. Under the start menu, there should be, uh, a minor right crosswind. Nothing fly out to for a transponder and you'll yeah. be able to select normal. I believe the switch will select. Oh, I see. Uh, it's in the pilot edge. Uh, how about now? Number six here, Papa. I do am receiving your remote uh, Charlie. Now contact uh, tower. A little bit fast. Uh, contact tower, and I assume this is one one nine point nine er. Number six here, Papa. F. Is that landing attitude? Settle so, nose down. No brakes yet. The flaps come in. 
not that satisfying. Alright, and some brakes on. Oh, a little too much. Uh, John Wayne Tower. Uh, Man, that's satisfying. Cessna Fortress that is so absurdly satisfying. Two zero left at and where are we going to park? Close the truck. Right, left side. Four three six zero Papa John Wayne Tower runway two zero left. Clear for takeoff. Make left close traffic. Report midfield on the downwind each pass. Clear for takeoff two zero left. Uh, close traffic. Report downwind four three six zero Papa. Number six zero Papa. Like to report midfield on the downwind, please. Midfield four three six zero Papa. Douglas 4 Tango Delta cross runway 27 left, continue ground via Alpha and monitor Gillespie ground 120.7. So long. Cross uh, 27 left, remain on Alpha and we'll monitor ground. Douglas 4 Tango Delta, thanks. Ground 21.7. Man, that was so satisfying. So absurdly satisfying. Lights are off. I can't even begin to describe how. Yeah, I feel like a kid again. I missed all of the chat today. That's how I know I'm having a good time, is because I haven't had any breathing room whatsoever. Everybody, watch out. Coming in. Pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Uh, excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Sorry. Excuse me. Sorry. Engines are cooling thusly. And fuel pumps are off. The tot heats can go off. Generators are off. Lights are our oh, beacons gotta stay on while the sp spinny things are doing their business. And well below 75 or 100 degrees, obviously. It's definitely not. And all the throttles back because shot cooling is someone else's problem today. We are good. Yes. Um, yeah, I did see someone asking about the way the windows are set up, and this is not like I use like a super big field of view. My field of view is probably set to I think it's set to like 105, and the default's about 70, so that's why. But I just I I like being able to see everything. And it doesn't bother me at all. It probably sucks for you guys, which is unfortunate, but... Who wants to see a replay? I do. Uh, replay mode. Uh, not too far there, fella. It's a little bit of flaps. Oh, look at that. Thing of beauty. The sound's gonna goof up in the replay, but it's okay. Yeah. Speed was a little higher than I wanted it here. I was at about 90 knots. See you hear me cut it there. Look at the rudder working. It's so good. 
Yeah, man, I tapped the brakes and the tail wheel came up on me. Ah. Such a beautiful airplane to fly, man. It's so good. So if you're looking for a challenge, man, this is the one. This is definitely the one. So much work to fly. So it's too bad the uh, Flight Some Economy thing didn't work out. I had like $17,000 of this stuff lined up. Uh, but no big deal, like it was the catalyst for a fun flight, and that's the whole reason they do Flight Some Economy, right? Um, yeah, I really like this. You'll definitely see me flying this a little more. Cool. So is uh, Dirtbag still around? Yeah, Lumber's still here. Lumber, I got time for a quick R22 race. If you're ready to go, man, just uh, shoot me a call on Skype.